Hope sore for any trainer with a winning two-year-old, and that's especially true for Ben Colbrook, whose honor code called Bama Breeze, Breeze to Victory, here at Churchill Downs under the Twin Spires. You know, I had gotten good reports from him from Bill Harrigan, and uh, who had him before he came to me. He hadn't been with me long. Uh, he worked out of the gate with a filly that, uh, you know, belonged to Helen Alexander, that we were, uh, so she, they worked a very, very good half. And, uh, you know, he was coming into this race, I thought, very well. He never got tired in any of his works, and he seemed like, you know, distance, two turns, first time out, wasn't going to be a problem for him. From the inside post, you know, our plan was with the rail being out to try to get a good position early on, maybe even be on the lead if, we, if he could get it. And then, you know, he doesn't really, you know, kind of get in the race early. And with, I think with the rail being out, that's, a, that's not the best place to be. And then, you know, Corey rode him great, saved all the ground. And then when it was time, he kind of found a seam. And when he found the seam, man, he really ran home. He did everything right before the race. He had a very good mind. Um, I think the, the stamina, you know, I think um, Honor Code, you know, was a very good miler and had a great pedigree and a great rest, race record and a great physical. And I think you can see a little bit of that in Bama Breeze. He's the first honor code I have had in the barn, and I was very pleased to get an honor code in the barn. You know, I think distance is not going to be a problem for him. I mean, you watched his gallop out, and then it was probably a little bit more impressive than even the race, his gallop out. So, I mean, I think he could be a true mile and a quarter type horse.